Yep, we are live, bro. Okay, so let me close this down. All right. Jesse, can you hear me? Yep. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, we are live. Let me say what's up to folks out there in Facebook land. Um, first of all, man, I'm, I'm glad to have you. It's an honor. Um, can't stress that enough. Whenever I get a chance, this, this is a selfish pleasure. You know, whenever I get a chance to to interview folks who are, you know, making money for themselves, um, being associated with our social club, it's, it means something, man. It really means something. It makes my day. So um, congratulations. I'm excited for you. Um, and, and for those who are watching, um, we have an amazing social club. We call it social club slash book club. We share things with each other. Just actually right before I jumped on this, uh, somebody sent me an in uh, inbox and hey, you need to take a look at this. And I was like, not right now, we're busy. But uh, but we share things with one another. You know, people bring ideas, we share ideas similar to how you would share ideas at a cookout, uh, uh, the barbershop, um, cigar bar, uh, country club, whatever. You know, and that's what we do. And as a result, folks have made some astonishing money, you know, where they no longer have debt, where there's some people made more money they've ever made in their life. You know, literally, we haven't been a year yet. We'll be a year June 28th. I mean, sorry, June 11th, 2021. And it's just absolutely awesome. And so today, I get a chance, the opportunity to interview, you know, Jackson Armstrong. Yo, yo, Jackson, you know, it's funny. When we grew up, when we was messing with somebody, we used to be like, yo, what's up, Jackson? That wasn't their name, but we was like, what's up, Jackson? <laughs> you know, like, I was like, what's up, player? We'd be like, what's up, Jackson? So, so, so. Now I get a chance to interview Jackson Armstrong today, ladies and gentlemen, um, who's achieved the Millionaire Circle Ring. Um, what that says that he's participated in enough of our phases where he's put himself in a position to make some, well, he's making serious money right now. And he'll tell you about that, but also put himself in his family in a position to make a whole bunch more. And so, man, glad to have you today, bro. How you doing? I'm doing really good. I appreciate you having me on. Um, it's really, I mean, been in the group for a little while now and the things I've been seeing have really changed the way I, I take, I look at the big picture. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I like to say you got a nice back background there. I appreciate that. I mean, I feel like I'm in outer space right now just because of, I mean, participating in the phases that I'm in now has definitely put me in a position to make more money for the family and really to just change, change the whole aspect of uh, how we're going to live life in the future. Wonderful. So, so you married with kids? Yep, married. Uh, one uh, got a son. He'll be two in July. Wonderful. Yep. Congratulations. I got two girls. They said we're not real parents until we outnumbered. So, cool. join the out, join the real not parent clubs. <laughs> keep telling me he need a friend to play with, but I'm like, uh, he can play with me. <laughs> <laughs> man, man. Well, man, I'm excited for you. So, so, so you're part of UIGI. How'd you find out about us and uh, about the social club and how long ago? So uh, I actually had, um, it's, it's really weird. You know how you get those random messages from people and you're like, oh, stop messaging me. So <laughs> guy actually messaged me and he was like, hey, take a look at this. And I, I opened the first phase that we, that I jumped on. And the, this is actually the second time that I've seen this phase. And I was like, uh, I told him no at first, but then I was okay. like, okay, let me, let me take a look. Cause I'm, I'm usually open to looking at stuff if, if people bring it to me. So I took a look at it and then I think I still said no, but then he gave me some more information and then I was like, okay, I'll give it a try. And once, once I saw that the team for that phase was dedicated to improving and getting people, helping people make money, uh, I jumped in. So, um, yeah, it's been ever since then. I've been looking at all the new phases that's coming out, and I'm like, okay, I can do, I can do this, or I would use another one phase to get into a different phase. So, um, something that was important to me was not necessarily putting up my money. So the first phase, of course, I put my money up, but then I let that grow, and then I used, I got my principal back, and then I used the money, extra money, to start another phase. So now I'm playing with house money. And the risk is diminished from there. Brilliant, 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 bro. I love to hear that, man. Every time I hear that, it makes me feel good because that's how we started this premise. We was like, look, you know, don't play with any money you can't afford to lose, you know, 
And as soon as you find yourself in profit mode, you know, start using house money and the rest is history. Man, that, that is great to hear, man. Congratulations, congratulations, congratulations. Um, how long ago did you find UIGI? It was in November of last year. November, good. So, heck, it, it, it's been about, what, like eight months? Eight months, yeah. Yeah, that, that's, that's solid, solid. So, so, so what's your favorite phase? I always like to ask this one. It's been, it's been a growing joke. On I, I could bet money what people will say, but what's your favorite phase? So uh, ever since I saw it, I was like, I got to get one of those. The, the Amazon Walmart store. My man. Okay. Oh, and that's to be able to have that passive income coming every two weeks and not have to, essentially not have to do anything after getting it set up is, uh, <laughs> I mean, everybody wants passive income. So that'll give me more time to spend with my son and more time to do activities. Something that is really important to me was attending events for my son in the future. So I've been looking at ways to free up time now. So whenever he's of age and he has sports events, he has whatever events he has, I want to be there. Um, Cause that wasn't something that, that happened for me. So I wanted to make sure it happened for him. Yeah. That's crazy. You say that. So, so I was an all state athlete, right. Mm -hmm. and, and my parents are the best, but they were just working, you know, it is what it is. And I was all state um, in track. I was third team in football, um, went to Rutgers university. And my parents at the time, again, and I ain't mad at all. You know, my mother and I went out to lunch the other day and I said, you daddy and my stepdad, my grandmother, you know, y'all did the best that y'all could. You know, we lacked nothing. We, we, we ain't had no money, but we lacked nothing else. <laughs> I, told them, I said, you know what? Um, I was an all-state athlete and no one ever came to a game. Mm -hmm. Not one, you know? And when I think about that, now my daughter, and, and that doesn't take anything away from my parents. No, you know, no. but just like you, some years ago, I said to myself, I wasn't going to miss a game, mm -hmm. you know, so I've, I, I've been coaching my daughter since fifth grade. Um, you know, my other daughter's in gymnastics, uh, like, bro, that you're doing, you're doing, you're doing the things, you know, to put some passive income in place, just like you said, so you never miss anything. Mm -hmm. And, and they say one of the best ways to show love is with the word T-I-M-E and that's time. You know, so kudos to you, man. That's a big deal. I appreciate it. Wow. There's so many people who join UIGI to make extra money. And I never, sometimes I don't ask, like, what's the reason? And this is one of the reasons it's admirable. And I know there are people watching right now, like, damn, you know, I like to be in the same position. You know, that's, that's, that's cool, man. That's cool. So, so the Amazon stores, like, like folks don't understand, man, Amazon, and I have an Amazon store and I have a Walmart store, right? Mm -hmm. You know, you know, the cool thing, here's a little quick tip. Here's a quick hack. For everybody out there so so um well let me ask you use a debit card for your float money or a credit card right actually uh connected to my business and i just got a um i just got a american express gold card for business so i'm all about leveraging uh leveraging other people's money if i can if that my man <laughs> so so we use our aviator card through mastercard for flying points so we fly free now we get so many darn points and I use my American Express Platinum card and we get all these darn points. So here's the crazy thing, you know, with the Amazon and Walmart stores, you know, we're making every time they charge our card, I mean, the sale is made, you know, and so we're racking up so much points. And one thing I just learned, bro, when I was broke, didn't nobody want to give you a damn thing, right? <laughs> but, but now that you, you got American Express Platinum and you got some cash, people throw money and points and stuff at you like it's going out of style. Oh, yeah. It is crazy. It's crazy. So good. I love that you love the Amazon store because because our whole, you know, one of our whole premises, the foundations of our our platforms is, you know, we got this little crypto stuff going on here. Use some of that, you know, to have a solid foundation with retail because retail ain't never going nowhere. You know, and 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 we have our mortgage notes. You know, properties ain't never going anywhere. Yeah, that's you know? my that's my next goal. Uh to get in uh, the mortgage notes because I know, like you said, property isn't going anywhere. And the company that I attach my Walmart store to is a real estate company. So once I get that, uh, start getting those notes, either selling or holding. Like, I'm all about passive income right now. It's, Man, uh, I love it. Yeah. Yeah, this is cool. How old are you, bro? I'm 32. If I was thinking this way when I was 32, I'd be a problem. Like, <laughs> literally. 
I'm, I'm being honest with you, man. I was a late bloomer when it comes to, you know, I, I guess I had a decent head on my shoulders, but not like this. You know, I was locked into network marketing and I was building a business and locked in. And now I'm in the I quadrant. I ain't never, ever, 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 ever going back to the B quadrant. You know, ever. <laughs> ever you shoot my foot off if you see me step in the B quadrant. <laughs> like, that ain't happening. Well, man, this is cool, bro. So, so okay, so you got involved with some of the phases. You start to use some of that money to parlay into the other phases. You know, we talk about the one-third rule a lot. Um, have you been able to use that philosophy to help at all? Uh, not in the beginning, just because I wanted, I mean, when you put that ring out there, I was like, okay, what's the fastest way I can get to this <laughs> ring? Because I, I, make, I make pretty good money outside of this, but I'm not. So I was like, okay, if I can do this, of course, with taxes. So I kind of did the 50-50 rule instead of the three. Okay, okay. So, um, but yeah, the three, three-third rule is, is amazing. Just thinking about it, it'll definitely put you in a position to get some freedom, especially from that debt that is going to... That is a, a lot of reason why a lot of people don't do a lot of stuff. Like, oh man, I can't afford this. Like, well, you got to figure out a way to do it. It's <laughs> I'm a no excuse type of person for real. So if 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 I can control it, then I'll put my best effort forward. And if it doesn't work out, then it wasn't meant to be. I love it. I love it. So what you did, you just went heavy on the compound. <laughs> you said I don't need the extra third to go to debt. Let me just compound this, make this money faster. Yep. Yeah, I hear that quite often too. I love it. That, that's 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 cool. That's cool. So so okay. So as you know, we we we're pre-launching a new phase right now. We can't say the name of it, but what do you think about it? Oh man, it's awesome. Uh, just the the ability to double your money is it's gonna be ridiculous. Uh, once I and the ability to help more people double their money is I think where it's really at. Um, I'm in financial services part time also, but um, so I like to help people grow their money and being able to be in this phase is definitely a way to do that. So. Uh, cool. So on the other aspect, so see, you're one of the people who and we get a lot of folks like you that are licensed financial planners and brokers and they come play with us, too. Now, they don't jeopardize their license because they let folks know, you know, look, this is a social club, but when it comes to you know, financial annuities and all that other stuff, they still stay in that lane. If I'm not mistaken, you're, you're with the great company, uh, Primerica. Yep, Primerica. I've been with them for a little over three years now. Um, originally started in Colorado and then got moved over here because my wife's in the military. So um, we got yes, or moved to Maryland. And I think it, like I said, I believe everything happens for a reason. I got paired up with a good, a great coach. So he's been teaching me all the things I need to know as far as money, taxes, how to save. So it's good to have a mentor to, to be like, hey, I did this. You shouldn't do this. <laughs> so uh, that's one of the big things I think a lot of people don't understand about some network marketing companies, like mentors are everywhere in them. So if you can find a good one and latch on to a mail, it'll definitely change your life. But I can't agree with you more. You know, as of late, I've been speaking to my mentors more than ever before. You know, my wife and I, we're moving to bigger, large levels. Like we've never imagined. No, we did imagine. Let me get that out. <laughs> it, got us, uh, it starts with the imagination, right? <laughs> exactly. So I ain't going to lie and say we didn't imagine to be where we are right now. You know, I'm in a position right now, you know, I have a friend who, who's, you know, a mentor who's talking to me about buying my own private jet, you know, and I can, you know, but I said to him, man, what do I know about buying a private jet? Like, I'll teach you. You know, so you say you might, it's time, it's time for you, Rabu, to start flying private. I'm like, damn, you know, and we did imagine this stuff, but now then more than ever, like I'm spending so much time talking to my mentors and I tell people, everybody should have some mentors, Yeah. you know, some, not just one, you know, some, um, and it's important because if, if you're the only one steering the ship and you're leaning on your own understanding, you're a sad tadpole, you know, <laughs> real talk. You know, so I, I applaud you for that, man. That's a big deal. That what you just said sets you 80% above the rest, you know, and, and that's a big deal. And, and your family and your, you will be will be better for it. So that's good stuff, man. So, 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 so we talk about mentorship. We talk about the Amazon stores. The fact that you're using this money to parlay into other money is, is, is incredible. Now, what did you do? prior to you know your three months starting in financial services what did you do prior to that i was actually in the air force for nine 
nine and a half years. Um, oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. I got medically separated. But like I said, again, everything happens for a reason. So it was meant for me to do, I guess, better things or bigger things. So once that happened, I got introduced to Primerica. And the first thing that intrigued me about the company was the mindset about money and how passive income is important and how to get free. So, um, of course, I've tried other things. Uh, I, I believe you have to try a few things to see what, what you're good at. But um, when I saw Primerica and the fact that just being a part of the company teaches me about money, it was a no-brainer to, to jump on, especially from people with 20 and 30 years of experience teaching me about things that I should do to better my position once it's time for me to retire. Um, and when I say retire, a lot of people are like, oh, I'm, not, I'm never going to retire. And it's like, well, I want the choice to be able to retire. Like a lot of people don't get that whenever they get to that age, they think it's uh, retirement as an age. It's really a amount of money. Um, Absolutely. You know, it's funny. I'm not one of those that say that I'm retired and ain't never going back. I mean, now make no mistake about it. If I get in a position where I got to go work at McDonald's to feed my family, I will. And I'll be the best darn burger flipper, you know, but bro, nah, uh -uh, I'm done. <laughs> when I say done, is done. I've, I've worked for 48. Well, I haven't worked for 48 years. I've been working since I was 12 years old. Um, you know, most of us as, as an entrepreneur, but like yourself, man, this leverage thing is ridiculous. You know, and, 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 and you know, you said the military. I, sh I'm, I know you saw the interview when we introduced Trace. We interviewed Trace. I know you was like, wow. Yeah, you know? I think that's what really got me going. I was like, okay, he's in the, he's in the Air Force or he's in the Air Force. Then I know that I can do, I can do whatever he did. So um, that really lit a, a fire under me too. Just seeing that somebody like me was doing great in the in the uh, in the group. Yeah, and see, and that's why we do these, man. Like, uh, we, I was, we, I want to interview you for a couple of reasons. No, number one, to give you a platform because I'm sure this happens to all of us. It happens to me every day. I still have friends and family. Well, I've been telling about this stuff, and I'm like, eh, I don't know. But when somebody else says something. <laughs> They're like, all right, send me that thing so I take a look at it. <laughs> send me that thing you talk about. Yep. Yeah. So, yeah. so that's that's one reason we do this. But then another reason to inspire, you know, you know, I appreciate your service. You know, I appreciate Trace's service. You know, I got a text from Trace the other day, and, and my wife and I, we were driving, uh, we were out, there's a Lambo day, you know, we have our Lambo days. We were out, we were driving, and it almost brought tears to my eyes. You know, Trace said, Hey, you know, I'm retiring now, you know. Mm -hmm because of what UIGI has been to him and his family and his wife will probably retire early next year. We have some stand up people that are part of our group, you know, and we can tell by, by, by some of your posts that you posted is they're not drama filled, you know, they're, 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 they're moving forward. They're forward thinking. And it's amazing, man. And, and we appreciate you for being you. We appreciate you for being part of this group and bringing value to the group. You know, that's a big deal. And I, and I, I want to say that to all of our ring earners, I can't, and everybody is part of our group. I can't say that enough. We appreciate you for bringing value to the group. It's a big deal. Oh, no problem. Like I said, I like to inspire others to to do to do better. I mean, if they want to, they definitely got to want it. A lot of people need more money, but well, a lot of people want. Wait, how do I say this? They need more money, but they don't want to put in the the effort to get it. So, um. You can't, like you said, you can't lead it. You can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. So uh, all I can do is be the example and hopefully some people uh, jump on. Mm, I love it. So here's a question. So what would you say to someone who's brand new, who just, they probably found a, somebody's promo page somewhere. Okay. They made their way to our Facebook group. What would you say to that person who's brand new, who's, who's got their toe in the water, fishing around, looking around, looking at the testimonies and things of that nature. What would you say to them? Uh, taking that first step to get started. Uh, I know it can be scary, especially whenever you're dealing with investing your hard-earned money, but take, I mean, little steps, even uh, uh, like with Tron Case, like that, that's a feeder. Like that has fed a lot of the things that I'm in just because of the, the way that it works. So taking that first step is going to be what's going to put you in a position to improve yourself. Um, like you can't, you can't get anywhere if you don't take any action. So um, in action. I love, I love it. So, you know, I can't disclose where we'll be uh, having our ring ceremony. However, it's set in stone. 
Um, it's been voted on. It's going to be a real hot place. I know you saw it because you're part of the group. Um, it's going to be incredible, man. Um, at this point right now, it'll just be the ring earners. Initially, it was going to be everybody. Um, but even though we're coming out of COVID, I've decided for the first inaugural one, it'll just be ring earners because um, they deserve to be there. Then next year, we'll do something for everybody. So, you know, I'm encouraging everybody. I'm sure you have some folks in your group that will come ring earners because we're going to have a damn good time. Oh, yeah. Definitely looking forward to having a few people uh, get that ring, too. Cool, cool. Uh, all right, all right. I'm not a big jewelry guy, personally, believe it or not. Now, I'm not a big jewelry guy. Um, I recently went to Dubai and purchased a watch, and two of my best friends talked me into buying this darn watch. Um, I like it now. And I, and I bought a, you know, a ring when I was over there. And I can't wait to get the, the I can't wait to get the Millionaire Circle ring, you know, to replace this one and pop that one on my finger. I might be walking around like Goldie, you know, <laughs> I might have like four rings on my hand. But, but man, wait, wait till you see that ring. I know you've seen pictures of it. Wait till you see it in person. It's, it's incredible. So, yeah, I'm not a real big, I guess, jewelry person either. My wife started buying me watches a couple of years ago. So okay, I'm getting, I guess, used to it. Nice watches and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm new to the game too, man. I'm, it, hey, we'll learn together. So, Definitely. man, but man, it, this is cool, bro. I appreciate you being available. I know um, with, with what you do for a living, uh, you're busy and and um, you got to get back to your family. What would you say? What would you leave folks to who are watching today? Um, people who are part of the group, not new people, but people who are already part of the group, people who don't know if they can go get the ring or whatever. What would you say to them? Uh, stay focused. Um, don't let the naysayers talk you out of a good thing. I see a lot of people, they'll go on on Google, or they'll go and they'll ask their friend that's never did anything like this, what they think. And of course, they're going to tell you it's something that you shouldn't get involved in or, or it's risky or whatnot. But you got to, I mean, you got to be your own person at some point and, and go for it. I love it, man. I love it. Yeah, bro. I appreciate your time. Um, again, extremely happy for you. Can't wait to meet you face to face in the disclosed hot location. We have a great time, um, a great, great, great time. And um, anything you need, you have my number. Reach out. Um, you need me to talk to any of your upcoming and future ring earners. Let me know. But man, let's do this thing, man. Um, and 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 I'm telling everybody out there, and, and I had to throw this because people are now reaching out to me about our um, about the celebrity softball game that we're we're sponsoring. In Cleveland, someone like, can I come? I'm like, yeah, you can always buy tickets and fly out there because they're going to be a big old party Saturday night or something like that. So, you know, for those who are watching, um, there's part of UIGI, or maybe those who aren't, you know, we'll be in Cleveland um, June 11th and 12th. And afterwards, it's going to be a big old party Saturday night, you know, blah, 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 with a whole bunch of celebrities that we might be able to get you in. But I uh, just got to throw that out there too. But man, um, thanks for your time, bro. Let's, let's, let's keep this thing rocking. Definitely. I appreciate it. Definitely going to see about coming to that, <laughs> that game. Um, All right. Cool, cool, cool. All right, man. Well, you enjoy the rest of your day. My daughter just called me. She at the beach with her girlfriend. So I let her, voice, I let her go to voicemail. But let me call her right back before she called me back and say, you know, it could have been an emergency. And I know it's not. So. Okay. <laughs> All right. You have a good day. All right, bro. You have a good one. Peace.